Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. You already know what time it is because you've seen the title but yes I am doing a Zara haul and it's quite an exciting one for me because I'm going on holiday soon so I had a deep dive delve into the new in spring summer collection so let's just get into it because I really want to see what I've got um, and see whether it's going to be good for my holiday so yeah I hate when Zara do this, but it came in two packages. So I've got one little flimsy package, and then I've got one big box package here as well. So that is quite annoying. I don't like having too much packaging because it's not good for the environment, but it's Zara's fault, not mine. I feel like the most sensible place to start is a little measly little package here. Um, I think it's only got one thing in, which is why it's even more annoying that they had to put one thing in this package, but oh well. And it meant I had to go to my post office twice to get things delivered to the post office so I don't bug my neighbours, <laughs> basically. Oh god, it's really sticky. First thing I got was this lovely off the shoulder kind of like crinkle material long sleeved off the shoulder top and the reason I got this is because on the model it looked so nice and I'm going to South Africa in a few weeks where it could be quite cool in the evenings so I thought like a nice off the shoulder um, top would look quite nice in the evenings if it's cooler. You can never go wrong with a white top either, they go with everything. I say that as wearing a white top. Okay, let's go into the big old box. That's the size I want it. First thing. <laughs> so nice is this um, strapless dress. It's quite long, I think it's like more midi length, mesh material, um, beautiful colour, uh, wow, this is so nice, it's got ruching up the side, it's like a purpley and orangey burnt sunsetty kind of colour, I just thought this would look so nice on holiday and I am going to a wedding so I do have a dress but a backup dress is always a good idea. Can't wait to try this on actually. I think that's gonna be lovely. This is a silk shirt, but it's got ties down the middle. And I just thought with a tan, how nice would this silky material be? And again, because I think the evenings might be a bit cooler, I'm thinking instead of wearing a jacket, wear a long sleeve top. Um, you can tell I love white tops because whenever I go on holiday, I seem to buy a shitload of them. So, yeah, silky top. I'm excited to try that on and try and style as well, actually, because it's tied here. So I wonder, I do wonder what it would look like. <laughs> this is far too tight on the arms and just a little bit revealing for what I like, but it is cute if you are, you know, more confident than me. You can tell it's summer themed because everything I'm pulling out is like nice, lovely colors. But the next one is this orange dress. Now it's double lined at the top, but not at the bottom. I don't know if you can see that. You can't see it. But yeah, it's double lined until here. And then it's not. So you're gonna have to be careful what underwear you wear, I guess. Um, but I think, I'm hoping that means you don't have to wear a bra, which would be nice. But yeah, orange dress. Who doesn't like the color orange when you're on holiday? Because I do. And the, the, I might be going for this colour nail as well, so I'd really match them. Look like a bloody Satsuma. Next, I have, whoa, this is quite oversized actually. Um, I went for medium because I wanted it oversized, but I think it was oversized anyway. So, <laughs> see how this looks. But I've got this linen shirt because there's nothing better than a linen shirt as a like a bikini cover up. Um, especially when it's a really soft material. This isn't as soft as I probably would have hoped. 
Um, I had this amazing one from Accessorize, I think, from years ago, and that's what I used to wear as my cover up, but then it got like a stain on it. I think one of my bikinis stained it, which is just really annoying. Um, so I've got this one to kind of replicate that, but I think I need to test it out before I fully commit to it because at the moment it seems a little bit stiffer. But maybe I'm just being picky, <laughs> probably. But yeah, I kind of the main reason I bought this was for more of a cover up kind of vibes over a shirt. <laughs> I forgot what this is. <laughs> I think it's a halter neck top. Yeah, it must be. Yeah, I got this halter neck top, but now I'm looking at it. Is this going to be too big for me? I'm not sure. But again, white top. I need to chill out with the white tops, don't I? But halter neck top, lovely material, structured. Thought it would look nice. Who knows? I'm concerned about the fitting of that now because I don't know whether it will suit my body type, but. We shall see. What is this? I've like low-key forgot what I've got. Oh, I know what this is. I got this top because I thought it looked like the Kylie Jenner stuff that she's been bringing out. It's got like that kind of tie here. It's like rolled and then it's like off the shouldery. So yeah, I thought it gave off Kylie Jenner vibes and it was I th probably not way less money. <laughs> Yeah, £15 for Kylie Jenner vibes. I've said Kylie Jenner far too many times. I'm not doing the best with my vocabulary today. But you have to let me off because I have been super, super duper ill and I'm just coming off the back of that. Midi skirt. Oh, oh I got this in a medium. I don't know whether I should have got it in small. Oh, no. It's lovely as well. A really long, lovely pink satin skirt, but... I'm thinking this could be a bit too large. Actually, I don't know. We'll see. But yeah, I love midi skirts and things like you can throw on in the evening that are still comfortable but look really nice. So that's why I got this pink one. And I've been looking for a colour like this that's nice and bright but also not neon. I hate neon. Even though I've just got that orange dress which you could argue is neon. But... <laughs> I actually love this skirt, it's just too big and whilst I wish I had the confidence to wear it low rise, I do not. <laughs> so I'll either have to buy a small size, it's a gorgeous colour, or should I just send it back? Oh I don't know what to do. Ah. Then, keeping with the kind of South Africa holiday vibe, I've got these green kind of loose looking kind of cargo-y, tied waist, linen-y tight trousers. <laughs> um, hopefully these look nice. Um, but yeah, I really like these and they're a nice colour. Guys, as I was putting these trousers on, this just broke out of them. I literally pu like pulled it to tie it. <laughs> That's so stupid. Well, these are definitely going back. They're really nice as well, nice colour. Yeah, that's so annoying. And then lastly in my haul, a very short but sweet one this time, because to be honest there wasn't that much summer stuff in because I know I'm quite early to it this year. Um, but I wanted to get ahead of the game and get some stuff for holiday, so I this is the best of what I can find. Loads of stuff coming soon though that I couldn't actually order so maybe I'll do another one in a few months time. But the last one was this denim skirt and it looks like it's been folded up. It's given that kind of vibes that it came with um, a matching jacket but I just didn't think I needed the jacket. Um, but the skirt I thought was really nice. The only problem is I don't know if it's too short um, but I'm gonna give it a go nonetheless. But I thought it was really cute and it was a little bit different and it's quite thick material, um, hopefully good quality, we'll see. In all of this I kind of went for a medium which I don't usually do and so I don't know why I've done it. Um, so we'll see if it fits, you can go on this journey with me. Um, but that is literally it for the Zara haul. I hope you enjoyed. There are going to be a few more clothing videos coming up because I have been doing a little bit of shopping ready for my holiday. So if you liked this one and you want to see what else I bought, let me know. 
and yeah I hope you liked the items I picked and if there's anything you think you think I should look out for on Zara let me know as well I'm always into a trend I'm trying to think of what else I need to say but I don't think I have anything else to say I love you all and I always appreciate you watching me so thank you so much <laughs> <laughs>